In this lesson, you will learn more about your mouse. It is used to select by moving and clicking on icons or tabs. It is rather like a bar of soap with a cable attached to it. It is plugged into the back of the console as I demonstrated earlier. The mouse is either plugged into a serial port known as COM1, PS2 or a USB port in the back of your console. It is best to attach cables to the computer while it is turned off but USBs do not require the computer to be turned off. As a result, if your mouse is USB, then you can attach it to the computer while it is still on. A mouse comes with its own software which can be installed with the help of Windows Add or Remove Programs tab. This software contains the drivers needed for your mouse to function properly on your computer. It is best to keep an area on your desktop on which your mouse can move easily. You can get a mouse pad which will allow you to easily move your cursor on the screen as it is a lot less slippery than your desktop. It is very important to hold your mouse in the correct position so that your hand does not get tired. Many people hold it with their palms. In this method, the thumb lies along the left edge and the ring finger lies on the right edge. The middle fingers are used to click on the buttons. There are many types of mice, but the regular ones used nowadays are wheel mouse button, which has a right click button and a left click button and a scroll button to move up and down in the middle.